Hey, how you doing, guys? Uh, I want to talk about uh, this topic now. I have a, a Garmin. Uh, I think it's a Nuvi 1300, which is um, for GPS navigation for my car. I prefer to use that. And um, it does have lifetime maps on it, so you can update it on a regular basis. And that's what you should do uh, every year uh, because you got roads um, being built in in construction going on so obviously you need to uh, update it to uh, take account of, of that and uh, new features and, and so on now Garmin came out in, in the past with um, like three or four different software programs it was very confusing uh, they seem to uh, do away with that now and they got this integrated program that does a lot of the functions together which is the Garmin Express so we're going to take a look at that when I first uh, installed it, uh, it automatically found my connected device by USB. And here you can uh, add another device depending on uh, different profiles. And as you can see here, uh, I just updated that earlier. It had both uh, maps and this right here. And uh, from here, you can uh, back up as well before you update. So if you have any saved places, waypoints, and routes, obviously. And uh, extras, which are mainly if you want to uh, customize the uh, icons and things like that. Um, another problem that I also had with it, it was very confusing because often uh, the, G the Garmin has uh, basic mapping which is just for the major highways now if you want to go into detail the individual roads uh, going off those major highways you have to download your region and it, the space is limited so that it's very kind of, it was confusing before because I, I didn't know uh, exactly how to erase that and put the new one in there uh, which they seem to fix and which I'm going to show you here um, we're going to uh, change the maps right here. And we're going to change the reasons just to show you here. And here it says there's not enough space. And before you had to kind of figure out what to do. But here it kind of gives you some advice, different ways you can get around this. And uh, here you can insert a memory card and uh, put it on that. And here you could also choose a region. Uh, instead of trying to download the whole thing to uh, save space. And this is the one that I used earlier. Right here. And then, of course, it also shows you um, how much space you have left and how much you used. So I think that's great on Garmin. They finally fixed that uh, program 100%, 1,000% uh, much better.